Hello everyone, in the previous video we had defined load combinations but we will be back to the to edit these load combinations if we find after running analysis if we find that there is a torsional irregularity on the structure so you can go back to check orthogonal effect video I will put the link in the description and we will talk about the frame and release for columns and beams later on in this video we will run the analysis and e tabs but before running analysis we will apply these few steps and after running analysis we will check for fastest check for deflection auto relabel all this will clean the model and make the model lighter for example if you defined a section add new any any section you can see that the default name is f section one okay okay now delete this section okay go back to define a new section you can see that property name is f section two but we deleted F section one but after relabeling all edit auto relabel all yes go to define section and add the new property you can see that the name is F section one to make the software calculate the center of frigidity go to analyze set load case to run and calculate diaphragm centers of rigidity now you have to check for errors check model go to check model select all without this option keep this to one millimeter and click ok you will have an error for the non frame section we'll see that we have this error to avoid this error just select all stories and select this non beam non frame I will define a small section frame add new for example 10 centimeters by 10 or maybe 5 centimeters by 5 okay and assign this new section for the selected frames apply and now you can see that there is no error We have no warnings. Now you can run uh, the analysis. After running the analysis, just start the animation. This is the dis displacement due to uh, dead load. We can check that all deflection is normal if you have if you can't see this deflection then there is a part that is not stable the building will not move but as we can see the building is moving in, in a normal way and that's it for this video